Well, hello everyone. I was just walking by in Ebonheart and look who popped up. Hello, Archmage Shalador. Well met, Adept. We... Uh, we are in need of your assistance. Velasta translated the latest book? Sort of. Velast has translated Sheagorath's tome, but we're having some trouble understanding it. She may need your assistance. Seek her out, as soon as you can. Uh, where can I find her? Velast is working the problem out of the Stormhold Guild Hall. This one. See you there, Adept. Okay, uh, duh, why is this one proving so difficult? The Mad God is a deranged skeever. <laughs> That's why it's proving so difficult. There's not so much actual text. The last two have had clues we could use to unravel his nonsense. This one is nothing but nonsense. <laughs> happiness is loneliness. Loneliness is happiness. Uh, goodbye. Alright. Uh, Stormhold. I have not gotten there yet, and I don't know if I will get there anytime soon. So actually, I'm gonna walk by here. Uh, I think Fighter's Guild is just on the other side. Yeah. I'm gonna walk Hello by Fighter's Guild and see if I can get an update for that one. Yes, indeed. What she will spawn in. Come on. I need to see you, Vera Moore Smith, in order to accept the thing from you. There you are, comrade. I have an urgent message for you. What is it? Guildmaster sees all colors. Would like to see you as soon as possible. She said the journal has revealed something about the Vivicus, whatever that is. She awaits you at the Guild Hall. Where can I find her? You can find her in the Hall in Mordor, comrade. May the Eight protect you. Uh, did you see what's happening? No idea. Word around the hall is that she's been working day and night on some mysterious project. I've even seen some mages guild scribes wandering around the place. Strange. Strange indeed. Goodbye. So to know exactly what she was doing. Uh, so let us select this one. It's level 15. Still, sh it shouldn't be too hard. Um. Hello. You are flipping a coin. The That's actually hero of Davon's watch. That's actually what now I a uh, emote. To see destroy the Daggerfall army. Yeah, and then he kind of went crazy, and you are Khajiit. Of course, I'm a I'm an Altmer anyway. Okay, anyway, uh, uh, where are we going now? We're going. What is the next place? Uh, um. I've forgotten what the next place is called. Mornhold is in Deshaun. That's what it's called. Deshaun. We want to go here. Oh, there's a few uh, dungeons for me to explore here. And this place is awfully barren. I probably should explore that point. That place at some point. I haven't finished Deshaun yet. Which means I can't do the next Mage's Guild thing until I've moved on to there. So... I mean, I could try, but I don't really want to get into that yet. Anyway. Off to Deshaun. To do things for Fighters Guild. Because rah rah rah, Fighters Guild. <sighs> I'm still depressed that no friends are playing anymore because I can't do group dungeons. Or it's not as easy to do group dungeons. It's easier to do things like that when you can actually communicate with your group in something besides typing. Uh, I'm still trying to convince some friends of mine to play it, and it's it's not going well. It's kind of depressing. It's actually extremely depressing. Oh well. I don't blame them though. I mean, it is freaking a lot of money. It's not actually that much when you think about it, but still, it's it's money that most people don't want to spare, especially for a game. So yeah, I wonder how long this loading screen is gonna take, or if I should just cut it out. I should probably cut it out because all I'm doing is separating out my change. Cause I have I don't have a ton of it, but I have a bunch. And I need to dig out my quarters and see how many of those I have. Yeah, I'll cut out this loading screen. Uh, hold on. If I can reach it. Nope! 
Hit the wrong thing. Dang it. My fingers are not that long. Come on, computer. Stop being stupid. BRB, yo. Okay, so here we are in the Mournhold Guildhall. Let us go upstairs and go find Guildmaster C's all colors. And someone just leveled up. Hooray! And of course, there's Aleph and Merrick. Let's talk to them first. Welcome back to the arms of the guild, comrade. How are you doing? Because it totally wasn't just, you know, a half hour ago that I saw you. You find me well, Stendar be praised. Dosha's tender ministrations are the worst to befall me in some time. Tender attention and the kindness of my comrades have restored me to health. So much tenderness from you. Uh, did we learn? Did you learn anything from Dosha's journal? Seize all colors would be the one to ask about that, oh my comrade. Oh my comrade. I have seen the journal, but have little idea what it says. <laughs> Give me a problem I can solve with a stout weapon. Those are the problems I enjoy. I'm sure. I've spoken like a true brutish red guard. Ugh. This one greets your return, comrade. I'm sure you do, Aleph. How are you doing? Aleph is well, moons be bright for asking. She worries about the time and money spent on this quest. We destroy anchors, slaughter Daedra. But what is accomplished? Did you learn anything from Dosha's journal? Ask our dear guild master, comrade. She spent many favors and much coin having it translated, and refuses to share the results with Alev. If Alev cannot be trusted, who can? Who indeed, Alev? Who indeed? Stupid cat. Good to see you again, comrade. You recall our encounter with Dosha, yes? Unfortunately, When we yes. found her encoded journal? Yeah, has it been translated? Yes. We called in several favors to do it, but we've cracked her code. Yay! In service to her dark master, Dosha was after something hidden in a dwarven ruin, a place known as Mazenelt. Mazenelt? What was she looking for? We're not sure, but it seems to have something to do with that more tomb Vivicus her notes mentioned. Mazenelt is far from here, but I've prepared a portal that will carry us across Tamriel. Yay! What do you say, Portals. comrade? Venture with me into the unknown? Let's do it! I'll open the portal. Takes just a moment. Just need I'll take about this. Okay. Portal! Here we go! And it's a solo dungeon! Yay! Everything is a solo dungeon! Although, interestingly enough, Sometimes the uh, main quest and other other quests do involve like just random world dungeons. It's kind of cool, as you remember from main quest, I believe. Uh, I was going around with Abner Thorn in a main in a, in a world dungeon once. It was like there are, there are world dungeons or par, I guess. Yeah, just just dungeons, world dungeons, I tend to call them. And there are public dungeons, which they seem to be changing the uh, the symbol for that like every other day. And then there are group dungeons, which they also seem to be changing the symbol for that every with every update. It's just oh, it's hard to keep track anymore. Now they look like caves. I think group dungeons are caves with plus signs. They used to all just be torches, but now it's just world dungeons with torches. Everything changes, and we have eternal loading screens again. What can I figure out to talk about? I have money. I have... I have clinky coins. I have more... more coins. Oh, we're here! Yep, no more coins. Alright. Guildmaster, Cecil Colors. Dosha was no scholar. She did nothing idly. The river has brought us here for a reason. Well, uh, what are we looking for? A treasure of some kind. A potent weapon, or an epic spell. Dosha respected only one thing. Power. Whatever it is, we must get it away from here. Okay then, why the urgency? Dosha knew of this place, and so others do as well. If we don't retrieve whatever it is, others will come. 
And it must have something to do with that Mortum Vivicus. If Molag Baal plans to unleash that weapon again, we must stop it. Uh, what do you think of this? The last days of the Dwemer were endless oh. war. Their mages raced to perfect ever more esoteric spells, ever more powerful weapons. Perhaps the origins of the Vivicus stem from that long gone era. Well, that's a possibility. Oh, what is this a place? A holdfast of the Dwemer, the dwarves. We're somewhere in Hammerfell, I think, near the South Dragon Tail Mountains. Or so Dosha's notes say. Uh, do you know where the where the dwarves went, Cecil Colors? If you do, you will be heralded for all eternity as the uh, wisest person on the planet. <laughs> if I did, I'd be the wisest woman in Tamriel, See? Comrade. Told you. No. No one knows what made the dwarves disappear. Or at least, no one is safe. I think it had something to do with, um... Their, you know, hubris. They, had, they were very guilty of that. Uh, why Hammerfell? Why does the river take us anywhere? The Dwemer built complexes all throughout northern Tamriel. My guess is that we're at this ruin for a treasure of some kind. If just any dwarven ruin would do, there are closer places than Mazenot. Uh, well, can you remind me about Dosha? Because we totally don't know who she is. Dosha kidnapped our comrade Merrick. Yeah. She intended to harvest his soul for Molag Bal. Yep. In service to a plan involving this Mortum Vivicus. Yep. And then, of course, you came to his rescue. Slew her and stole her journal, which is what led us here. Did you learn anything else from Dosha's journal? Many things. The journal spoke of this place, but it also spoke of terrible things. Ter terrible things. Things I wish I could unlearn. Prolonged contact with Molag Bal twisted her mind. I'm sure it did. I mean, she was a freaking harvester anyway, so... Come here, Twilight. You're gonna help us. Because you're amazing. Yeah, I don't have my clan fair out anymore. I may get them both at some point, but for now, I'll just live with one. Oh. Hello, what gross. in Nern? The undead are close behind us. We must hide the remains of the weapon. Now! The automatons are still active. We'll die down here. We will see this done. Omolag Bal's hunters will chew on our bones. Kurano is right. With any luck, the constructs will hold back the dead. Let's move. I still think this plan is madness. Those were ancient ones. Aliens in a Dwemer ruin. What went on here? Well, they were aliens. <laughs> aliens do things. Let us fight! Fight the Wamer constructs. Alright. That thing's dead. Blades ready, comrade! These constructs know no mercy! I looked oh hey! Dwarven spears counter as a boss creature. Or er, spear, not spear. My ultimate is taking a long time to charge up here. My, uh, my twilight's gone. Okay, it's dead. Oh, right then. Um, there's probably something down one of these hallways. Die, spider, die! Books. Heavy armor. Forge wife's advice. Y'all can read that. It's written by orcs. Ugh. Alright. You can pause it if you didn't have enough time to read it there. We shall... Let's shoot things. Okay. Burn and electrify. <laughs> Alright. Uh, there's nothing over here, is there? No, oh, nothing at all. I can't even loot the chest. Dang it. Alright. Do do do. Do 
do do do do heavy door alright Corino is dead the weapon will be lost forever no there's still hope Osterand will have to do it Oblivion take you I can't we can still succeed but you'll have to enact the sacrifice my friend without a soul in the crystal there will be no way to repair the weapon it must be done, Osteran. A sacrifice? What did they come here to do? Well, that sucks. Kurnos Journal. Mullet balls, ravenous hordes, claw at the gates of Deladil. The wave of undeath comes from the city of Abagarlas, as always, and Meridia has shown us a dire warning. Meridia is very involved with everything. Um, Their king has begun plans for a magical rite. Ritual with a focus of power that will drain all life from our home without some kind of dramatic act. Delo Deal will be lost. King Cinadelin Sine himself has asked me to form a plan. We have the power, the magicka, and the skill. We must be able to stop these inhuman monsters. The plan has begun. We forged a weapon. It took much sacrifice. But the weapon will stop the ritual in this Mortum Vizvicus we've learned about. Uh, our group has been tasked with entering the hated city of Abagarlas and ending the threat. Meanwhile, King Cinadelin will ride against the Dark City's walls. With his full host and the might of Meridia behind him, we can win the day. It is done. King Animario's entire family is put to the sword, and Abagarlas itself destroyed by the righteous lightning of Mer righteous lightning of Meridia. The ritual has stopped, but we cannot go home. The weapon was ruined in the attempt. We have we've sal we've salvaged the prismatic core at its heart, and carry with us the plans to construct the weapon anew. We are hunted by the beasts of Molagba. We must get to this we must get the crystal to safety. But we dare not lead these creatures home. Almost a week, with all with all the while hunted by death, we dare not return to Della to Della Deal now. The beasts would have destroy would destroy our home and take the crystal. Instead, we did I'll learn how to read eventually. Instead, we've determined we must try to hide the core and the tomes we, of instructions. A dwarven ru a dwarven ruin called Mizendelt however it's pronounced, is close by. It should suffice as a final resting place for these precious relics. I pray Valasha is ready for what must be done. But is Valasha going to be sacrificed? But since Kurino died, they're going to do someone else? I don't the remember. The skill it took to craft these constructs. Amazing. Oh, hello. You're another dwarf with spear. Spear. Why do I keep saying spear? I don't know. It's annoying. Come here, you. Do not kill my toilet. Oh, you just wore a spear. It's dead. Cool. Alright. Now let's go. Heavy door. Another heavy door. All the doors are heavy in this place. Do 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 Lanas Journal. Just read it. what this place must have looked like in the time of the Dwemer. Yes, yes, it looks quite marvelous, I'm sure. Ugh. Lana's journal. I owe everything to Ednar. He saved me from the dark manipulations of Abagarla's king. He showed me the light of Meridia. I think I would let him attempt this mission without me at his side. To think I would let him attempt this mission without me at his side. I don't know the details. Uh, and anything that puts a shiv in Molag Bal's eye will make me rest easier. We barely escaped Abagarlas. The fighting was intense, and I still can't believe what happened. Since our escape, vampire assassins and ghoulish huntsmen have dogged her every step. Kurno says we're heading to Mizelt. Min Min yeah, that place. Uh, I'm not sure how a dwarven city figures into the plans, but I'm not here to think. Our goal is to safeguard the crystal they took from the weapon and some book. We've been searching the mountains for weeks now, traveling far to the e far into the eastern peaks. Insane, Mur. So you're not a Mur? 
who are you? Uh, I worry Ednar has lost his mind, but then again, there's a lot I don't understand about this trip. At least I'm still alive. Yeah, that obviously didn't turn out too well. Open the door. 